All right, let's determine the slope of these linear equations. And we always want to have the linear equations in this format, y equals mx plus b, in order to figure out the slope, which is just always m. Uh, that means that we need to isolate y. So let's isolate y here. I will start by taking 3x from both sides of the equation. So those go away. And we have 2y equals negative 3x plus 6. All right, now I can divide both sides by 2. And y is equivalent to negative 3 over 2x plus 3. 6 over 2, 3. That means that our slope is negative 3 over 2 in this case. What about over here? Now I will. I want to isolate y, so I'm going to take the 4x and the negative 2 over to the right side of the equation by subtracting 4x and adding 2 to both sides of the equation. These cancel out, those cancel out. So we have 3y equals negative 4x plus 2. And at this point, I can divide both sides by 3. I don't know if you guys can hear this, but there's just your construction working workers banging outside uh, <laughs> the office here. That's crazy. All right, so we have negative 4 over 3x plus 2 over 3. And that means that our slope, slope of this linear equation is, or this linear function is negative 4 over 3. That's it.